Hey guys, this is Soumya and welcome back to my channel Colors of Life with Soumya. Through this channel, I bring you every week for new and creative art and craft related ideas. However, this week I am going to bring only Christmas related ideas for you because it's Christmas time guys. So here I have ordered some art supplies specifically for Christmas and I am going to use this to make some DIY items for my this year's Christmas decoration. So let's quickly get into the video. So among all the items that I ordered, here I also ordered one pre-primed canvas. So this is a canvas with a Christmas, uh, you know, uh, sketching done on top of it. Just the outline thing is printed on the canvas. Now what happens with this kind of canvas is that this actually helps you to do the coloring straight away and you don't need to spend time on drawing the making the outline drawing rather and okay also it has got a few couple of colors and one brush along with it however the quality of the colors were not very good so I thought that it was like simple coloring karne ke bhaje, let me give it a twist so as usual I decided to use this time clay like of course my favorite molded clay and I decided I'll not use too much of clay otherwise the canvas will unnecessarily become very heavy so I'll use clay on uh, like in bits and parts to provide some highlight and the 3d effect uh, to maybe some of the you know Christmas tree ornaments the cherries on the wreath then the muffler of the snowman the um, you know Christmas hat so all these small little things so that it doesn't becomes too heavy so now this is the color that they have provided but uh, the quality of the color is actually not good so i decided to use this color as well as my usual acrylic colors so to begin with i decided to paint the background first by using different shades of blue specifically uh, you know cobalt blue and then mixing a little bit of white along with it to get a nice sky blue color and then a little bit of white here and there to give it give the effect of a day sky and to highlight some of the parts with uh, prussian blue so post that I started with a wreath. Now wreath ko color karne ke liye leaves hai and cherries hai and ribbons hai. So basically leaves ke liye maine yaha teen shades use ki hai yellow, light leaf green and dark green. And same for the Christmas tree. Of course Christmas tree ko mein sirf leaf green or dark green se karungi. Or uske baad when the first coat uh, dries up then I'm going to use uh, a little uh, darker shade of green and I want to make some uh, you know prominent brush strokes on top of it just to give it a highlight like this similarly is painting me jitne bhi leaves hai uh, main yehi same technique use karke in sare elements ko complete karungi so is drawing me jaha bhi maine clay se 3d effect create ki hai so uh, the first thing that I have done is that I have put a clay ke upar ek priming coat laga di hai, which is nothing but gesso because when you apply a coat of gesso or even white acrylic color it gives you a nice base to apply any color so uh, now I have decided to paint since it is Christmas so red is the predominant color so is green so muffler jo hai wo main red or green se karungi hat let me think about it I'll make it look nice so ab dekh sakte ho niche jitne bhi gift boxes draw kiya hua hai sabko maine different alag alag colors se paint karne ki koshish ki hai because I know jitne bhi cherries hai ribbons hai isme mujhe orange or red hi use karna hai because there is no other color of course i'll use I, i'll you know mix and match the colors i'll make a lot of highlights i'll give some special effect because without that my painting is always incomplete once the wreath is done now we are left with two other alphabets that is j and y which comes to j o y joy because Christmas is a festival, not only Christmas, for me, each and every festival brings to me a lot of joy. So, um, for J and Y, I have decided again to use red, but this time I'm not going to fill the letters with this particular color. I'm just going to do a bordering with the color and then a little bit mess up the color and just will give it a shade, you know, kind of a shading. 
सो गाइज इफ यू हैव लाइक माई प्रोसेस एंड इंजॉय इट सो फार प्लीज डू नॉट फोगेट टू लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब द चैनल फॉर पीपल हु आर न्यू टू दिस चैनल एंड अदर्स प्लीज डू नॉट फोगेट टू कमेंट डाउन बिलो रादर लीव अ रेड हार्ट एट द बॉटम सो दैट विल गिव मी अ लॉट ऑफ इंस्परेशन एंड अफकोर्स एनी ऑफ योर फ्रेंड्स एंड फैमिलीज हु आर इंटरेस्टेड इन वॉचिंग दिस काइंड ऑफ आर्ट वीडियोज प्लीज डू शेयर इट विद दैम इट विल बी रियली हेल्पफुल फॉर दैम so coming back once again to the main video we are done with most of the base colorings and now it's time for some light and shadow action and some you know like we do some ornamentations to the christmas tree and some more uh, highlighting to the other elements so initially i decided to make the snowman's cap with black color but then i felt no i'll change the color and also i realized one thing that the background is actually not uh, looking good at all so i decided to change the background to navy blue and black combination and i have shaded it and i have colored it with that and now look how bright and how beautiful it's turning out to be so i'm just going to add a little bit of kind of you know stars and all at the back and the snowman's cap yes of course i told you i'm going to paint it with yellow so coming back to the christmas tree ornaments i'm going to use small little you know stickers i have like silver golden and then i have some mirrors i'm also going to apply those Also I feel like using the rhinestone chain on top of the bow. So let's see how it turns out to be. So with this we are almost done and here is the final output. Also do not forget to varnish it otherwise all the efforts go wasted in the near future. So do let me know how you like it. So till then bye bye and merry christmas to all of you and see you again until in my next video.